Today's daily for July 8th, 2019, Monday. Air signs. Air signs, you're running back and forth with a situation. You're pretty much driving yourself crazy over maybe a certain uh, person's value that they have with you, or value to you. I also feel like um, air signs are also dealing with value as far as the cost of something. Maybe the prices are too high for you, or maybe the rent, the mortgage, the purchase amount is all too high for you. Whatever it is, it feels like a lot of air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, is, is trying to contemplate uh, a move. Um, and when I spoke of a purchase, meaning of a home, a place to live, a place to rent, a place to buy, whichever. Um, it feels like a lot of you are trying to decide to um, get up and move out or move forward. But at the same time, you want to be very careful of the areas you choose to move to. For some of you, you're trying to do an upgrade and get to a better area, a safer area, a more secure place. For some of you, your finances aren't really allowing you uh, to get yourself uh, to the point where you want to be because your finances are just restricting you. Um, but it does feel like there's going to be opportunities for you to find that perfect place, which gives you balance, gives you the freedom of being able to sleep calmly at night, not worrying about being in a bad area or negative things or people. Air signs, where love is concerned for today, it, it feels like you, maybe you're still feeling a little bit unbalanced or imbalanced over something. But I do feel like Air signs are going to be able to adjust to a new situation. That could be a new relationship. It could be a new way of living. Um, but I do feel like there is a lot of adjustments coming up for air signs. Air signs, including in your adjustment, is going to be a transformation. So if you're starting to feel a little blah, if you're starting to feel a little bit like you, you don't know what to do anymore, you don't know where to go, you don't know who to hang out with, you don't know where to be. I do feel like it's going to, uh, it's, it's, it's definitely going to smooth out soon. <clears throat> it's definitely going to smooth out soon, so don't worry about that. Um, those of you who are single, uh, air signs, just know that the person that you were with is going over the shit that they did trying to I don't know, forgive themselves maybe, or trying, maybe some of them are trying to get out of it, saying that they did, they weren't responsible for this, that, and the other thing, when in fact they were. But I do feel like, <coughs> excuse me, but I do feel like it, it's totally a thing of the past because a lot of you have already moved on from this person. This person may come back in contact with you, so be aware of that, okay? All right, fire signs. Fire signs for today, it feels like you have an owl, an owl, O-W-L, an owl in your pocket or an owl around you. Um, it, it feels like somebody's got their eyes on you. You know, an owl sits very quietly and still and watches. And the only part of their body that moves is their head. And that's what I feel like. Somebody is around watching you very carefully. Keeping a close eye, fire signs. So if you're aware who this may be, um, this may make sense to you for some of you. There's also going to be um, certain type of rules or stipulations or boundaries set up for you today, fire signs. And I don't know who that's for or what it's about. Um, but it does feel like there's certain... Certain boundaries are important to have. I feel like you're being told fire signs, and it is to keep the negative people away from you um, or the toxic people away from you. But also, to fire signs, maybe someone is feeling like they're putting a boundary up, keeping you away. Somebody, fire signs, may be holding you back, keeping you from doing what you want to do or being where you want to be. So just be careful with that, okay? Then you have the also the... Um, I keep hearing yellow brick road, yellow brick road. So if some of you fire signs are 
walking down the same path. And that's what this is talking about. Doing the same things every day. Expecting to get a different outcome. Walking that same path in life. Dealing with the same people. A lot of you are going to be really disappointed. Because a lot of you are going to see that you're wasting your time. And not understanding why. So, so you know, be real hesitant about that, okay? Try to make different choices, different decisions. Even if it's just to create change. If you normally drive home one way, drive a whole different way home today just to see the difference, just to see something new. Take the long way home, so to speak. <clears throat> All right. In love, fire signs. For a lot of you, there, there has been a reconnection or a reconciliation or it is the beginning of. For some of you, there is still a lot of distance and some people may have you blocked, may not be speaking to you, may not... Uh, be responding to a text message, but you'll know who that is. For some of you fire signs, um, there's options and opportunities that are coming your way, and I do feel like you can expect an unexpected invitation. That feels very strong for you guys. Water signs. Water signs, you're all about your work and your money. Once again, finally trying to get that savings account up where it needs to be. Some of you water signs <coughs> have thrown in the towel on a certain situation, not wanting to go back and, and do something, um, not wanting to go back and do something that's going to put you to your knees, so to speak, give you weakness, put you in a whole wrong area, direction, location. Some of you um, finally realize that the person that you were with, you weren't, they weren't, they weren't good enough for you. A lot of you water signs are finally figuring that out. A lot of you water signs are finally figuring out too that some of the friends that you kept close to you, who you thought you could trust, who you thought was in your corner, who you thought was doing things in your best interest, wasn't. They were all about themselves. And now I'm not saying everybody and everybody's friend is bad. I'm not saying that. You'll know which person I'm speaking about if this is for you. <clears throat> I also feel like there's something to do with um, a test drive. Somebody may be going to take a test drive today, water signs. Maybe you're going to purchase a new vehicle. Maybe you're going to try out a new situation. Maybe you're going to be in a new relationship. So you're going to take it for a test drive, so to speak. Whichever way that applies for you. Some of you may be caregivers out there, taking care of other people, doing um, nurses' aid work or home health aid work or something of that nature. Some of you may be taking care of a family member. Some of you may be feeling of overwhelmed. That's the whole thing I'm seeing about this. Taking care of others is feeling overwhelmed, feeling like you don't know um, how to get a break, wanting to take a break, wanting to go on vacation, wanting to just take some time away from everything, and it is very positive in your favor. So it feels like that's coming your way by August. <clears throat> some of you are in for a long vacation or a long haul. Some of you may want to decide to take advantage of um, collaboration, putting something together. Building something, creating a new, um, I want to say web page, a new business. So we definitely wanted to create something new. Uh, let me see, for earth signs. For earth signs, it, it feels like you're counting the change in your pocket. For earth signs, it feels like you're trying to be very careful about how much money you have, how much money you spend. You may also be trying to... Um, I'm going to say ration stuff out, put certain envelopes out for certain bills for the month. It looks like you're putting a little bit of money into each envelope. Some of you may actually be thinking that opportunity that is coming upon you may be making you nervous. It may be a choice or decision that you have to make that is really, really uh, choking you by the neck, meaning you're feeling strained or stressed about it. Some of you may decide that there's going to be uh, something better out there for you, something better coming towards you. You may feel like you're not sitting in a particular chair or seat very well, uh, whatever that means for some of you. Some of you may feel that this new job that you took isn't working out, but it actually is. 
I feel like there is going to be balance coming and you're going to actually love the job that you have. You just got to take a little bit longer to adjust to it. For some of you, I feel like you're taking the royal step. When I hear royal step, it means um, either you're taking more than you, biting off more than you could chew. Either you're trying to um, allow something to surface that hasn't been able to. Um, there's energy around you guys, earth signs, that I keep seeing red, red, red. So either there's a lot of love or there's a lot of anger. There's a lot of um, disarray. There's also a lot of tension going on. So whatever's going on with earth signs, it feels like there's a lot of tension, uh, um, a lot of stress. Um, there may be something that you're trying to create a balance to, but not sure how to get that. Some of you may also be deciding on taking a walk. I keep hearing everything about movement, movement. So you may be deciding to take a walk on a daily basis. Maybe you're deciding to walk 30 minutes every day. Maybe you're deciding to walk away. But it's really strong for earth signs. Something about movement, walking, could be running. Maybe a fear of something. Somebody may be walking at nighttime in the dark. Could be home from work, home from school, wherever. But it feels like it's nighttime. And I feel like you're a little bit nervous walking. I don't like you walking in the area that you're at. I don't feel like there's enough people. So if you're walking down a path, if you're walking through a field, a park, anything that's in the dark by yourself, do not do that anymore. That comes through very, very strong. So please don't do that anymore, okay? Um, for some of you, you may be doing a lot of cooking. You may be getting a lot of different meals together. You may be trying to create something new. It feels like it is sweet and savory. I don't feel like it is a dessert, but more of a meal. Um, meaning more of a protein type base. So whoever that's for, keep doing it because I feel like it will become very successful. Or somebody is writing a recipe book. And this is going to turn out very well. For some of you who are writing regular books that have to do with fiction or nonfiction, I do feel the possibility of this being um, world-renowned is going to be very big. Some of you have details through dreams that you've been receiving and you're making notes and journaling that every day. Keep doing that because the answers or messages that you need to hear will be there. It is coming. You'll be able to put the pieces of the puzzle together. So that's what I have for today, being July 8th, Monday, 2019. Um, hopefully you guys will join me for a live. Uh, there's a lot of people sending me messages about wanting to do um, the mini reads for $100. So if that's the case, um, I will be coming online to do mini reads for $100 or um, $50 for one question. So I will be talking to you very soon. See you guys.